That's the best I can do for a dance, because there's definitely no dance scripting here. Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. And I think I realized why I missed so many things in the last part, like visually. I had my monitor tilted a different way than, <laughs> than it should have been, and yeah, that's never a good thing, because you got the LCD all wrapped up in different colors, then yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Anyway, I'm gonna go warp on over here and try and get down over to the grassy area from a high place so I can see what I might be missing down the... No, it's actually more back. Actually, well, actually, I think that's, yeah, I think that's the location there. Uh, I could have just long jumped over there, couldn't I? <laughs> well, well, that's... That's lovely, but... <laughs> so, yeah, there's apparently something around here? According to that? Is it you? Is it because you're having a shower? Nah, that can't be it. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember there... What was over here, unless it's something... High up. Oh, there is... Glidon? Is, is that... Is that what I'm looking for here? Is Glidon to get that moon? I that that sounds plausible. Probably. Yeah, I don't remember how I got this one. <laughs> uh, we're gonna find out once again once we get turned to the right location. Yeah, it's like somewhere down that way, but I don't. Like I want to be sure I got enough, like the angle and stuff like. Yeah, that's gotta be how I did it, or, or maybe I long jumped into it or something like that. Alright, here we go, here we go, I got it. Above the Iron Mountain Path. But the question is, was this how it was intended? I don't know. <laughs> but that's how I got it. Um, I suppose what I could do is... Wait, wait, actually... Wait, no, you see... No, wait, what is the, the beginning of the... Like the... Like the flower bridge area, because I want to go to those little islands <laughs> where that one way out at the north portion is, just like a stray. And I'm just... I just went over to glide on, just because it's just simpler this way. <laughs> just kind of get myself flip-flopped over here. So yeah, apparently there's something... Wait, wait... It did the zoom thing again. So yeah, apparently there's something way, way over here, which normally you get to with the flower bridges, but... Well... <laughs> I, I, I don't know if that's really necessary when you have the power of Glidon. This one I got before, obviously. Yeah, but the other one... There's gotta be something around... Maybe it has to do with you. Do you wanna... Oh, you wanna see something! That's right! Visiting here to see the creatures that stretch up tall. We know so little about them. How to see one up close? Yeah, I remember that now, as soon as I seen it. So we gotta get an uproot over there. And to do that, we gotta start over here, I do believe. So we can't, so we can't just glide on over there. <laughs> uh, so, well, actually, I probably could have warped, I don't know, to the boss arena, and then maybe... Did, no, I, wait, no, I couldn't have, because there's no uproots to speak of past that point, I think. I think... Well, uh, actually, well, maybe there was, because there was... Was that down by that... because there's a secret path through there. Anyway, I'll just do it this way. Yeah, I was right, you could get an uproot down over there. Well, that's another way of getting one. So let's follow <laughs> the flowery path as close to the edge as you can, I would say, because it's kind of... We're kind of slow and don't have as much mobility as you do with Mario. I mean, sure, we have the height, but... Do we have the might? No, I don't think so. A creature that could stretch many times its height upward. I've been hoping to investigate one up close! So the reed telescope's out like so. I see! The mystery is solved! Yay indeed! I met an uproot. Well, he met an uproot. Thanks for supporting important research. You're welcome. So now that that... Was that the bird that's around this area? I think it is. I wonder if I can get that bird just by waiting around here with the uproot. Because uh, it does lapse around 
this boss tower here, and it, like it, lo it loops back around to here, but I don't know exactly where it passes over. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to get it from on top of that uh, girder over there, you know, jump from up there. But I see an opportunity to maybe get this bird he here. This is why I hate these birds, because their cycles just take so long. And <laughs> yeah, it's just yeah, anyway. Uh oh, that's that's not it. It doesn't fly close enough to the ground here? Okay. So I guess I'll try the other girder then. Or, you know, the one that I see on the other side. By jumping down this -a wait, no, that that's the wrong one. <laughs> By jumping down this way. Oh, I see the bird automatically starts there. On the cycle, maybe that's that's the key. It gives you just enough time to reach that girder from up here, and then, and then you hope for the best. <laughs> yeah, this one right here. This may be the place where I can potentially get the bird. I hope. Maybe I just uh, I hate these birds. Prepare yourself. Oh no 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 no! Whoa! Hate the birds! They're even hard to hit because they're so small. Okay. Now how do I get this? Without resetting. <laughs> okay! Bird traveling the floors. I hate those things so much! Worst idea! <laughs> I, mean, I guess they're entirely built on observance in that you have to watch their path and see where they're going and stuff like that, which is an okay mechanic, but their routes are so long! And they're so small, they're hard to hit! Ugh. And I was thinking about this this one by the X here that I said I couldn't figure out the other time. Oh, well, I figured it out, I think. I think. Go here. Remember that 8-bit area? Go in there and I betcha, I betcha, there's a note in here. I betcha! Nope. Just leads me all the way over there and... Uh-uh! <laughs> oh, wait! That nut? Maybe that nut? Can I hit that nut with glide on? Because I don't think I can... Oh, maybe I can get an uproot over there. Yeah, grabbing from, from the lower area. You know, where they're patrolling down yonder here. And yeah, maybe I'll try the uproot first. Because that's usually how you get something that's nut-based. Alright, here we go! I mean, you can obviously get one out of here. But I thought that was just for like exploring other places. I I, I could have swore I got this with Glide on before, but I mean, well maybe that is an alternate way of doing it, and this is not the. It's okay, it's okay, and that and uh, oh that's not where the nut was, and that's not the. Uh, oh I see invisible block. Yeah, because what I think I did before for the nut under the observation deck was I oh, I gotta leave it I guess. If I can warp, was grab glide on and did like a a pop out of his body and then half jumped over to the nut. I'll just see if I can re re experience that for you to show you an alternate method here. I guess you could say. Uh, so you go down and around. And, oh, that was just a horrible start. I don't, I don't know. Maybe I did get it with an uproot, or maybe I just tried this before and it was. Highly unsuccessful, that's why I ended up going with the uproots. I don't know. Oh shoot, that... Man, you take such a wide angle when you go. Okay... Is this... I don't know, maybe it's high enough to get the right angle. And turn, turn, turn... Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know, maybe it's possible to do it that way, but... Ah, I can't think of it right at the moment. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, those X's over there, and then that X up there. I suppose I could start out by going here and rechecking out those places. Because I have some theories, like maybe it's hinting that I have to put a seed somewhere that I forgot somewhere, because remember that the X marking was around this particular area here. No! Nope, it's not marking that particular place. Uh, is it like directly above here in some like really awkward jump fashion? 
Not that. Surely it's not that. Is it really that? I suppose that's possible that it could be that. Um, if so... Can't I get an uproot from up there and just take it on down through here? Perhaps. Perhaps not. I'm pretty sure I can because that bridge is... It was able to be traversed before with the uproot, so... Ah! I just want a shortcut here, if you don't mind. Thank you. <laughs> of course, you might, you obviously do mind because you're not not letting me shortcut things. All right, a brute. Let's go toot and not scare the residents too much or the tourists. Otherwise, they're gonna lose the money. They won't be able to water the fields. It's gonna be disastrous. Uh, okay, over here. Yes, it was. <laughs> That was a lot simpler than I thought it was, and not in the robot storeroom. Alrighty, then... Uh, oh, those two over there, I don't know, like... I wanna, like, zoom in to see, like, closer, but just, they just look like they're both inside the iron cage based on that angle, but that cannot be! It cannot be! <laughs> Because there's only one in the iron case, that one from the painting, that's how they work. It's those one-time dealios that you're able to look into from another angle that you can't get to some other way. Anyway, okay, just kind of take a look down, say here. Is it that note? Well, for one of them at least, it could be. Oh, that's... oh, how do I even... <laughs> Oh, I was supposed to have an uproot for that. Okay. Alright. Uh, at least I think I need an uproot for that. Uh, where can I get an uproot through here? Probably through there. Yeah, this, I'm, I'm getting the same uproot twice in a row here. For, this, for two different problems. <laughs> Should have just kept the uproot the whole time somehow. I don't know. I don't know if that would have even been possible. Because I, I kind of like, well, no, I guess it might have been. Because, yeah, well, oh, mmm. Mmm. Oh! I forgot all about this moon in here. Yeah! Oh, look at that! I just got that high up in the cave on this. It's kind of out of my intended pathway here, but. Yeah, I might as well grab it as long as I've seen it. But, okay, so maybe this isn't uproot accessible as I thought. I mean, even if I did the. Shaky, shaky to get even higher there. Yeah, that's not quite... So that's not it. At least not how to get that one there. So let's go loop around again. And... I guess try and get this at another angle. Like, well, try and get an up right there at another angle. Like, maybe... This one over here? Come on out! Come on out! I'm gonna take your body. I know that sounds bad, but I assure you it doesn't hurt at all. Okay, so... Don't be scared, it's just Mario. So that means... Okay, so you take one around here, and then I presume this is how... You get these notes here, with relative ease. Yeah. Yep, something like that, probably. Most likely, it sure seems like it. Go, 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 yeah! Yep. That would have been a little, little bit on the difficult side if you would use... Mario's triple jump and wall kicks and stuff like that, so that's how I thought. Yeah, the uproot seems like the most plausible thing. Alright, so... Oh, I just realized! That other one that was below the cage was also... That other X, so that means... Ah, yeah, it wasn't... It wasn't like something through here, it was through that little... Little pathway that was... Down through here. Ah, so this must have been directly underneath that cage. Okay. Anyway, hint heart. I mean, hit hint time. <laughs> I mean, I, I will probably get uh, um, like repeats of stuff that I already know the locations of, like said hint art and stuff like that. But uh, well, kind of, kind of unavoidable if we're getting hints for stuff. Uh, is that Sphinx? Like another quiz with Sphinx? It might be. <laughs> I don't know. I, no, I think Sphinx is up further ahead. Like over, uh, like 
Sphinx is over somewhere like here. Dang, stop locking on the things! Anyway, I'll, I will find out as we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Da, 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 da. Maybe I should just cut ahead until I get all the hints that I can get out of this hint toad here. Oh, by the way, a hint art... I'm, <laughs> I said hint art again. A hint that is all the way out in the abyss like that is referring to the deep woods, which, you know, I'm kind of going to cover that in a separate type of area dealio for the sake of organization and stuff like that. I know there's a couple of things that I forgot down there via a comment that I will uh, put on the screen when the, the time is right. <laughs> oh, the, oh, no, 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 oh! So there may be something at the bottom of that thing at Bobber after... No, wait, no, 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 that's not the boss arena. That's the uh, flower boss area. Yeah, that's... No, so it's not... Oh, maybe I was confusing those um, girder areas for one another. And that's why I kept going down to the one with the Yufu. Hmm... Hmm, could be. Yes, that UFO enemy is called Yufu. I, I rem yeah, <laughs> I remembered it after I made the part. Anyway, oh, I think that's the hint art. Anyway, cutting ahead again. Oh, we're done. Oh, and I just realized also that I mispronounced the Yufu. It's Yufo, not Yufu, but... <sighs> it's always me being dumb, I swear. Ooh, squirrel. Is that- wait, no, chipmunk! Chipmunk, they're coming out to eat you! No, oh, never mind. Never mind. I mean, I guess it could be a type of squirrel, but anyway. So, is this something that I'm looking for? That's... Mm, I mean, it's certainly plausible, since there's an X next to it. Could ca no, that is not. So, is it directly above here? Well, it probably is. It's probably on, like, the other side of that wall there. Let's go warp- OH NO, I CAN'T WARP! <laughs> Let's just say, let's warp to the nearest location. But if we go here... Uh... We aren't go- Oh, wait, 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 this is actually viable! I, I forgot all about that! Oh, so we could actually use that. <laughs> Surely it wasn't that note. No, no, that was on the other side of that. It was on, uh... It was on... Hmm... Yeah, it wasn't on this side of the wall, it was on the other side. So then is it there's something like hanging off the edge or something? We're about to find out! Ooh, well there's that I guess, but... Uh, little ledge there. I'm sure I... I'm sure I did the Toadette quest before <laughs> when I came through here before, but... Uh, I don't think there was like a path underneath that. At least I don't remember there being a path underneath that. Just kind of slid along the wall to kind of slow down the camera so I could take a look-see. Hmm. You could practice with that note that we've seen up there. Never mind, never mind. Hmm. I'll keep looking. I mean, how about... How about this rock? Oh, it's the other rock. Dang it! <laughs> dang it, dang it, dang it. And yes, I was underneath that tree to get purple coins before. Uh, you know that hole is? Yeah. If you just, just you don't think that I'm avoiding going under that tree. Come on, break already! Break already! Dang it! <laughs> I think it takes longer to do it with ground pounds than it does with, uh... It just little kicks around rolling rock in the woods. And there's your... Oh, no, wait. Maybe there were purple coins under that one. Maybe I'm thinking of the ones in Lost Woods. Okay, maybe I didn't check that one. <laughs> Alright. Um, I guess there. Because that's the, again, high point. I can just use Glide on to access something very quickly. It's kind of a spammy way of getting stuff, probably, but... Uh, well, maybe not. I don't know. I'm just going to see here. I think it's... I think what it's pointing out is there's something on this little ledge here? Long climb up here, right? Oof. Wait, what is this? Was this here? Hmm. Uh, oops. Just want to pinpoint the location here. Uh, is that inside the waterfall cave? Maybe? Because remember, there's... Ah! Music Toad! 
I forgot you were here! I always seem to forget where you are. <laughs> okay, which, which music are you looking for this time? And then you certain theme. Oh, Sky High Coins of Plenty. So we're going to look for a Super Mario World music or something like that, probably. Um, what is the bonus music? Uh, shoot. What was it called? Uh... I don't... Maybe? Uh... That could be it. Let's try it. Hmm, not quite right. Okay, yeah, let's try it again. I'm sure I've heard the music before. No? No. Uh-uh. <laughs> Another world? Maybe that. No, dang it! Nah, I'm still looking for that. Oh, of course! That's the music! Yes, this is it! This is the music I want to hear! Sure enough, as soon as I see the name of it, I, you know. Thank you! Here, this is for you! I guess the name was in exactly how he described it. Jamming in the Wooded Kingdom. Thanks for letting me hear so much music! As a thank you, here's some special Moon Kingdom music for ya! It's Honey Little Ridge, Escape, 8 Bit! I hope you enjoy it! Yeah, now we can listen to a new song. Wait, what am I? What? What am I doing? Why am I going like that? I think it's actually yeah, it's up the other way because we are past Honey Loon Ridge. This you not you you do not hear this. I should say you do not really get this normally. So just a little extra little bonus for you to listen to. And I guess we were back here. <laughs> No, I know. <laughs> I mean, it's just... I don't know, it's the simplest way. Because you get up so high and you have glide on and everything. Okay. So it's not that spot. It's somewhere down this way, right? Yeah. Okay, maybe... Do you want... Do you want something in particular over here? Or, or is it something hidden underneath? It's probably something underneath. Hmm. Or it could be above. That, that would also be plausible, I suppose, as well, because there's a whole other layer going on here. Uh, actually, no. Well, I mean, I guess a path could be above, I mean, but... Uh, hmm. This is very unfitting music again, but yet, I love the song, so I'm not cutting it this time. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Bowser escape music with Peach in that last moon room. Yeah. Uh, yeah I don't. Hmm. I don't know about that one. You know what? To satisfy my curiosity, maybe instead I should divert to the secret flower field entrance because I didn't really spend much time on that one anyway. So, yeah. <laughs> this will be the last one I'm getting this part. I swear. I don't think it's down in here. Same dealio, wonderful indeed. So yeah, that's definitely not the dealio I'm looking for down here. And I didn't see anything like embedded in the ground that's new or anything like that either, so... But I can at least use this to get up there relatively quickly, again. Oh, and there's a pole over there! That wasn't there before, was it? This here? Yeah, I don't think that pole was there before. It must have been, been put in there later on. After I took the 8-bit route or something like that, or at least I don't think it was there before. Huh. Huh, I say. Oh, wait a second. So maybe maybe it wasn't up there. And I was supposed to... Oh. And then this this may lead up top. Okay. Ooh, yeah. That better not take me to the deep woods. <laughs> oh. Well, that's fine, I guess. At least now that I know that there's a pole over there that I can... <laughs> I could use the pop back up there quick enough. You just climb up there and do the rigmarole again. Here we go again! I should probably get a decent running to start at this, because I got a long jump into... Whoa! Okay. I wonder if I should just do this, like, in time. Yeah, that was making a mountain out of a molehill the way that I did it before, with the rhythm that I was using there. Just, just hit it! Just... Hit the pole, and when you swing forward, jump off of it. Jeez, PK Gam. Alright, flower. 
our way back to the top. Or at least I'm betting that's how it's going to lead me. Yeah, that's what I thought. So I guess you don't get inside the other cage, and maybe the cage that I was thinking of was just, just had the purple coins or something like that. I don't know, but I swung around the secret flower field indeed. And with that, I think I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when we continue looking around for more moons in this place, I suppose. Lots of stuff to collect.